Hey folks, JP here. It's uh, Thursday, August 26th. Anyway, I just got to tell you, I got a bee removal today in Algiers, Louisiana. It's old Algiers. And uh, bees are right here. They're in the wall section. And we have a lap board again. And I don't have Shawi with me today. I'm also, I hate to admit, in a bad mood today, folks. You ever had one of them days where you just get up and you're kind of feeling ornery? Well, that's today. Kind of a bad mood. Part of it's probably because Shaw we uh, he left me with one of his high boxes that he makes, and uh, I gotta tell you, the bottom board is like an anchor and a top cover too. And I gotta bring that stuff all the way down the alley, so he ain't here, but I'm blaming him. And I'm gonna call him in a little bit and tell him too. That's all I'm saying, shall we? Is you gotta do something about them bottom boards and top covers. They, they're just too heavy. They weigh heavy more than the box itself. Anyway, other than that, I don't know what this weather's doing either. It's real overcast, and it's kind of actually a little bit cool today. Which, and I'm fine by that. It's because it's like 11 o'clock, which usually this time of the year, at least a couple of days ago, was so hot you could have been couldn't have, uh, you couldn't stand it. But uh, we cool right now. Uh, we may get some rain. I don't know, but fixing to get into this removal. We start off with a little smoke, folks, just to keep them honest. And yeah, I got my my clean queen catcher right here. Yeah, okay. So shall we? He puts it in his pocket, and uh, I'm putting it right here. So big deal. Moving big colonies, folks. But I got other things going on today. Should be seeing that hive in just a second. They're pretty healthy. They got good numbers. I can tell you that. So far, from what I've seen. Look at the honey. Like really healthy bees too, folks. Look nice and healthy. How about that, folks? Pretty, huh? Yes, indeed. See, I ain't that mad anymore. I'm in my element. Y'all can see I'm putting rubber bands on my wrist. You know, shall we gonna have something to say about that too? You know, I guess he got that copyrighted as well. He's he gonna claim he's the only one that ever did that before. Like, there ain't nobody else that put rubber bands on their wrist before. Trust me on that. I'm gonna hear it. It's like the queen clip I'm on my on my shirt there, on my collar. I ain't gonna. You know how he is. I called him. It got to be close to noon at this point. I ain't heard back from him. You gonna tell me he was fooling with some alligator? But, yeah, you know, you know he probably even had extra large shake. Uh huh. Yep. Oh, speak of the devil. Uh huh. You woke up finally. You woke up finally. I was just telling all these people that your bottom boards and your top covers are too heavy. <clears throat> Why are they so heavy like anchors? Oh. Ain't that heavy. It is heavy too. 
Well, anyway, look, I'm removing this hive in Algiers. I bet you wish you were here, hon. You, I know they got a queen in these. Yeah, you ain't gonna be able to find it. Well, you know there. I am. Huh. I'll be able to find okay. it faster because you ain't here. Got your honey bucket. I'm about to put some honey in there for you. Oh, oh. So you can put it on your van extra large vanilla shakes that you get every day. I don't get that every day. Every day. That's what you told me. No, you got no, a routine no, down. Alright, I'm going. Yeah, that was Shaw Weed, folks. He was at the Dairy Queen, I know it. He said he was cutting grass, but I don't believe it. Even shot, we could have found that queen, folks. <laughs> In fact, I think I'll call him and tell him. Yeah. Hey, man, I got the queen. I think even you, e yeah, even you could have found her. <laughs> what? Pretty, pretty much, she swole up in golden. Beautiful queen. Alright folks, so we got it done. We got a nice, healthy, beautiful queen. She's in the catcher, in the hive. Right now we're going to do a little be quick. Folks, this is called controlled chaos. <laughs> the wind direction is screwy, folks. I don't want to spray this stuff and then have it drift over to the bottom. We're going to have to move the hive. We had a shift in our wind direction. The idea is to run the bees off of the wall section where they were and orient the new setup here. Hey, thanks for watching. Another video brought to you by JP the Bee Man. Y'all have a good day now.